This video explores the critical process of cofferdam site assessment, detailing the techniques, challenges, and best practices for evaluating sites in waterlogged environments. It is designed for geotechnical engineers and contractors working on marine and construction projects like bridge piers, pipeline installations, and other related projects. Before we begin, we want to thank our sponsor and good friends at Jet Filter Systems. If you want to prevent retaining and seawall failure, well, how about saving money on repairs? Check out JetFilterSystem.com to learn more about their super efficient weep hold filters. Now back to the video. Understanding the basics of cofferdam site assessment. Cofferdam site assessment lays the groundwork for successful temporary cofferdam projects by ensuring all critical factors are evaluated before design and installation begin. What is cofferdam site assessment? Cofferdam site assessment is the process of evaluating environmental, geotechnical, and logistical factors, such as soil conditions, water dynamics, and site accessibility to design and install a temporary cofferdam effectively. This systematic approach, typically led by geotechnical engineers, ensures the cofferdam can create a safe, dry work area in waterlogged environments for construction projects. Key Objectives The primary goals of site assessment include determining soil stability to support the cofferdam structure, assessing water conditions like depth and flow to manage hydrostatic pressure, and identifying regulatory constraints such as environmental permits to ensure compliance. These objectives inform the cofferdam's design, ensuring it meets project requirements while minimizing risks of failure or delays. Common Applications Cofferdam site assessments are essential for projects like bridge pier construction, where a dry area is needed for foundation work in rivers, pipeline installation in lakes or coastal zones requiring precise underwater access, and dam repairs in reservoirs to isolate sections for safe maintenance. These applications highlight the need for thorough assessments to address site-specific challenges in marine and construction environments. Key Factors in Cofferdam Site Assessment A thorough cofferdam site assessment hinges on evaluating critical factors that influence design and installation, ensuring stability and compliance in challenging environments. Geotechnical Conditions Geotechnical conditions are assessed through soil testing, such as borehole sampling to evaluate soil type, shear strength, and bearing capacity, which determine the cofferdam's foundation stability. These tests, often conducted by geotechnical engineers, reveal whether the soil can support the structure or if additional reinforcement like deeper piles is needed to prevent settlement or failure. Hydrological and Hydraulic Analysis Hydrological and hydraulic analysis involves assessing water depth, current velocity, tidal fluctuations, and wave forces to design a cofferdam capable of withstanding hydrostatic pressure and dynamic water loads. Understanding these factors ensures the cofferdam's walls and ceiling systems can resist water forces, maintaining a dry work area throughout the project duration. Environmental and Ecological Considerations Environmental assessments focus on evaluating fish habitats, water quality, and sediment disturbance to minimize ecological impact and comply with regulations like the Clean Water Act. By identifying sensitive areas and potential impacts early, engineers can implement mitigation measures, such as silt curtains or fish relocation, to protect local ecosystems while meeting permitting requirements. Now before we continue, be sure to crush the like button and subscribe to receive more marine construction guides. We appreciate your support. Challenges in Cofferdam Site Assessment Cofferdam Site Assessment often encounters complex challenges that can impact project timelines and stability, requiring careful planning to overcome effectively. Unpredictable Subsurface Conditions Unpredictable subsurface conditions such as hidden soft soil layers or bedrock variations can complicate cofferdam design and installation by affecting load-bearing capacity and stability. These issues may lead to unexpected settlement or the need for deeper piles, necessitating thorough geotechnical surveys to identify and address them before construction begins. Dynamic Water Conditions Dynamic water conditions, including tidal changes, storm surges, or high currents, can skew assessment accuracy and challenge cofferdam stability by exerting variable forces on the structure. 
Engineers must account for these fluctuations during site assessment, using real-time monitoring to ensure the coffer dam design can withstand the most extreme water conditions expected during the project. Regulatory and permitting hurdles. Navigating environmental permits, such as those required under the Clean Water Act and local regulations, can delay projects if not addressed early, as they often involve strict guidelines on water quality and ecological impact. Early engagement with regulatory bodies and proactive compliance planning are essential to secure permits efficiently and avoid costly setbacks. Best Practices for Effective Site Assessment Adopting best practices in cofferdam site assessment ensures a robust foundation for design and installation, minimizing risks and enhancing project outcomes for geotechnical engineers. Comprehensive Data Collection Thorough field and lab testing such as borehole sampling and soil shear strength analysis is essential to build a complete picture of site conditions before cofferdam design begins. This comprehensive data collection helps identify potential issues like weak soil layers or high groundwater levels, enabling engineers to make informed decisions and avoid costly surprises during construction. Collaboration with experts. Collaborating with geologists, hydrologists, and environmental consultants ensures all factors such as subsurface stability, water dynamics, and ecological impacts are thoroughly considered during the assessment. This multidisciplinary approach fosters a holistic understanding of the site, improving the accuracy of the cofferdam design and ensuring compliance with environmental regulations. Contingency Planning Preparing for unexpected findings such as adjusting cofferdam design for unforeseen soft soil or modifying dewatering plans due to high groundwater is critical for maintaining project timelines and safety. Contingency planning allows engineers to adapt quickly to assessment results, ensuring the cofferdam can handle site-specific challenges without compromising stability or efficiency. Once again, we want to thank our sponsor, Jet Filter System. Check them out at jetfiltersystem.com or call 800-475-2029 to save money and prevent retaining and seawall failure.